Ford Focus and Fiesta 2012 to 2018 and 2011 Fiesta dual clutch assembly. You ever wonder what's inside these things anyway? <laughs> I tried to take one apart before and I couldn't get all the way through. However, today, with some brute force and determination and about $15 of cutoff wheels, okay, I've uh, got this uh, old clutch apart here and I wanted to show you guys what's inside them. Does that sound fun? Maybe we'll see why they shudder too. Does this look familiar to you, sort of, except maybe something missing there? <laughs> okay, let's let's go here. This is the top of the clutch, where the uh, clutch studs usually are for the nuts, for the flywheel. Mmm, yummy. <laughs> um, and this appears to be a, maybe a pressure plate of some sort. Yeah, that's got some mass to it. Wow, no burn spots. No grooving on the pressure plate. I'll tell you one thing, this thing was full of dust. Maybe that's why they shudder. All right, here's one of the uh, friction discs here. Okay. Um, doesn't seem fragile or hard or anything. Um, here's another pressure plate. Looks like there's a pressure plate on each side of the clutch. There's a little bearing in there. Okay. Once again, no grooving burn spots. Um, no major burn spots, I mean, on the uh, pressure plates here. Here's the uh, other clutch. These clutches both seem pretty thick. I um, believe this clutch had about, I don't know, at least 50 or 60,000 on it. The transmission had 100 on it. I'm sure it's not the original. But this thing, uh, you saw it on that video where I did the used transmission inspection. Um, it was a very used up clutch. This one's a little bit, got a little bit of burn spots on it. Um, the uh, little spots here, I believe, is just some grease or something, but uh, you can tell it's a little discolored and a little grooved here. Maybe that's uh, why uh, this clutch is probably shuddering here. It's not didn't have a firm bite on the pressure plate there. That's my theory on it. <laughs> and um, here's a uh, giant pressure plate, I believe, or uh, a ply plate. Where the Z washer on the slave cylinder pushes up. There's several of these springs that kind of came out and fell all over the place here. I <laughs> don't know if I mentioned, I went through a whole pack of cutoff wheels for this thing. Um, down to the last few things, just some plates and stuff that uh, go on the bottom of the clutch. Ooh. <laughs> I'm not really sure what these plates are. Um, but uh, I think it's got something to do with application. Another uh, another plate here for the, uh, the slave cylinder pushes on to apply the clutch. And here's the very bottom, the last piece. You know, when you have a clutch upside down, that's kind of what it looks like, except it's not in a million pieces. <laughs> but yeah, I just thought you guys might be interested in seeing what's inside these things. Oh, yeah, there you go. Thumbnail. <laughs> All right, you guys. Thanks for watching. I thought I hope this is entertaining for you. Have yourselves a great day. Um, if if you have any Focus transmission questions, I'm happy to help. I also have a Facebook and Discord group and a playlist full of Focus transmission assistance videos. Thank you guys for watching.